My sneeze always disappears. The moment uh, that... Oh, what? <laughs> you ruined it by talking. I did ruin it by talking. <laughs> Stop oh. burping or farting! No! I like making noises with all my orifices. <laughs> Let's take that up. <laughs> Stop recording! <laughs> I am a professional! Hello friends, wizards, witches and muggles! Welcome back to my channel. I hope you're all doing really well. Today we're going to be unboxing an Accio box. This video is in fact sponsored by Accio. I think this is the February box. So I'm very excited, intrigued to see what is inside. I also have a discount code for you guys if you are interested in getting your very own Accio box, which is Magical Family. This means that you guys get money off and it also means that I earn a little bit of money to help keep this channel running. So without further ado, let's get on with the unboxing. And also, if you're new here, Hello, welcome, don't forget you click the subscribe button if you like to become part of our weird, magical online family. Let's go. I had sugar before this. <laughs> okay then, so here we have an Accio box, as per usual, no spoilers. Don't know what the theme is. It's always quite fun to guess, so let's have a little floop and a little Let's give you, we solemnly swear that there's good stuff in shine. That's all you get in. <laughs> I'm kidding. Right, let's have a look. There is your cheeky sneak peek. Firstly, let's talk about this keyring because this is cute. So here we have it. We've got a little owl on there with an owl, with a letter. So it's like owl post and it says owl mail, magical delivered service. I think that's what it says. Uh, oh, magical delivery service. And it says London, UK, 323. It says drop in any mailbox, we guarantee postage. That is absolutely adorable. I love that it's in gold. I actually really love these keyrings. I think they're really, really cool. I think they're very, very retro. But yeah, love that. I think we've actually seen one of these from Accio before and I think it was for, it was either Grimald Place or the Leaky Cauldron. Can't remember which one it is, but either way, do like them. Big fan of that. So that's a cool start. What else we got in here? Oh, cute. We have Oh my god, this is so cool. This box is well good. There's so much going on. It's... Right, I think this classifies as one item. We've got some greetings cards and they're so nice. So we've got greetings from Romania. So we've got a bit of a, a Weasley card going on there. And then we've got happy birthday, Harry. I baked it myself, words and all. That's really, really cute. Loving that artwork. I think that's gorgeous. Then we've got working hard is important, but there's something that matters even more, believing in yourself. Love that. Love the artwork again. Really, really nice. And then it has got three uh, or two. I think there's two. Oh, right, yeah. So these ones go with those envelopes. And then this one. Oh, this one's not a cup. Ah! <laughs> Sorry, I think this might be a replica print. It's to Ronald Weasley from Charlie. This is adorable. So this is a postcard from Charles himself, Charlie Weasley. It says, Dear Ron, wanted to let you know how the new dragon is setting in, settling in here at the research centre. It gave my colleagues, col it gave my colleagues a bit of a scare flying over Vienna. Apparently it tried very hard to break out of the crate. It's a feisty one. We're letting it have a bit of a break to get acclimatized and then we should be able to tranquilize it for a full health assessment. Hope all is well at school. Try to stay out of trouble for the rest of your first year, okay? And speaking of trouble, give my love to Fred and George. That's adorable. Hopefully I'll be able to come down and see you all over the summer holidays. Love, Charlie. So yeah, it's got his address up here and then it's got Ronald Weasley, the boys dormitory, Gryffindor Tower. That's a really lovely paper replica actually. We don't see many, too many of these in Accio boxes, but that's really, really nice. I love that we've got owl mail on here. We've got a bit of a owl, owl post kind of vibe going on because so, we've got that and we can send these ourselves in the owl post. These are by, uh, I think it's Martinelli. 
and they are a watercolour artist. These are made specifically for Accio Box, which is really cool. Uh, I will link this artist down below because I actually really, really do like this style of artwork. I think it's really lush. I'm a big sucker for watercolour paints. Really nice quality as well, so I'm gonna have to save those and send them to someone special. Really nice envelopes as well. This is a really exciting box so far. So Alpost, I think, is the theme. Let's get, oh, we've got a t-shirt. Oh, it's a really nice kind of neutral gray color as well, which I'm kind of digging. Oh, this is cool. Okay, so we've got Owl Mail Magical Delivery Service on the front, which I think is pretty cool, but it doesn't end there because bam, we have got this on the back, which is really cool. It's kind of like retro. So it says, day or night, rain or shine, our owls will get it there on time. We guarantee it. Our mail magical delivery service proud to serve the magical community since 1477 i mean it's pretty cool i do like that it's very very retro and i do like the color of this top as well but yeah i love that i love that t-shirt i think it's really cool ah uh, let's move on then we've got something that looks really special in here so oh my god this is what it looks like it's this kind of faux this is actually made out of cardboard but it looks like faux leather and we have some silver foiling on the front here um it's plain on the back it's she's got a ribbon i think this might be a wax seal set Accio, this is beautiful no this is really be this is gorgeous let me get these escaped wiggly woos out this is a full like set this is beautiful i actually have a set of wax sealing equipment already but this is gorgeous so you get two tea lights and then you have a wax kind of it's you put your little wax pieces a couple of these into the spoon and then we will melt this over the candle like so and you can see that it's actually got a bit of a pouring lip so then you can pour that onto your post your owl mail as you as you wish and then once it's in place you will get your stamp which is actually really cool uh let me just screw this on a little tighter there we go um so yeah it's an owl mail wax seal stamp uh this is very high quality it feels fantastic it looks fantastic i think we could make some really nice wax seals with this but i am obsessed with this little jar of these little hexagon wax melts like this is genius that they've done this set like that's so nice like out we go so yeah you can put about four maybe four or five of these into the little melty spoon thing and i think that would create a really nice wax seal you can also buy these off the internet in a variety of different colors if you wanted to stock up but the fact that they've given us a really nice pourer and yeah they've given us everything that we could ever desire to kind of send our outpost and make it feel really magical i think that's beautiful and one of the nicest things that Accio have ever done in their boxes and i've been a fan of their boxes for quite a while but they have stepped it up with this I loved let's talk about it let's get to the cheat sheet first and we'll talk about what I have loved so here we have it the Accio Profit oh they've changed their cheat sheet feels nice it's a different shape it's nice anyway so the theme was magical mail and it says this month we celebrate our hard-working friends at the magical post office those with feathers and those without for making sure the mail always gets to where it needs to go. From fun and immersive to pretty and practical, we've curated a box that will add whimsy to your everyday life and help make your magical, well, sorry, help make your mail feel much less mundane. Words. Okay, so first we had the Owl Mail Staff Tea. So I guess you could wear that if you're working as at like the kind of postal service for wizards and witches sending all the owls off and that kind of thing that had a value for $20 and it says we imagine staffing the post offices in the magical world would be a very interesting job between managing a whole flock of owls and trying to ensure ensure that the mail gets to where it's going on time this tea is the latest in our fan favorite series of shop staff apparel designed to make you feel like you're really part of the wizarding universe printed as always on our signature buttery soft teas and 
designed in-house just for you. Very cool. Next up, we had a letter from Charlie Weasley, which I personally think is really cool. This had a value of $10. It says this magical replica imagines what communication might have looked like between Ron and his brother Charlie during the spring of Ron's first year after Charlie helped him smuggle a dragon out of the school. Designed after vintage travel postcards. Yep loving that. A dated owl mail postmark adds to the realism. An Accio exclusive and perfect addition to your Wisting shelf or print collection. Do like that, love a little replica. And then we had an owl mail wax seal kit, which let's be real, I'm pretty sure that stole the show. So it says, make your mail 100% more magical with the addition of an owl mail wax seal. Each kit comes with a wood handled metal stamp plus a bottle of wax beads in your house color. That is awesome. I really wanna see all the blue, yellow, and green ones of these. Send me pictures if you've received this because I wanna see what it looks like. A melting spoon and a pair of tea lights to heat the wax. All packaged in a fancy velvet lined box. Are you? Oh yes you are is quite soft and fancy and then it says designed and crafted just for us so you can't get it anywhere else and that had a value of $18. Then we had the watercolour greeting card set which was by Martinelli Artwork which I just love that. I really like these. I think they're really nice. I would be so chuffed to receive one of these in the owl mail. <laughs> so it says, we're delighted to be able to feature this greeting card set illustrated by Amy Martinelli, a talented watercolor artist from the UK. That's pretty cool. Each card comes with an envelope so they're ready to mail to a friend or loved one in need of encouragement or to help them celebrate their special day. Find more at martinelliartwork.etsy.com, which I will link down below. And then last but certainly not least, we have the owl mail vintage key fob it says this is by the three sisters design co and it says unlock your magical post box or just coral the keys to your ride coral corral probably probably pronouncing that wrong with this adorable and practical keyring designed in collaboration with the three sisters design company i don't think we've heard of this company before um or the designers of these so i'm definitely going to check them out i will leave their link down below it says inspired by the vintage motel keys each fob is hand stamped on a real vintage press this particular design is exclusive to akio so you can only find it in our shop but there are tons of other fun fandom references and quirky vintage upcycles to, to discover on their etsy page so that had a value of ten dollars the cards had a value of nine dollars um i really liked this theme i uh love these cards i enjoyed the replica the t-shirt yep liked that as well i like the key fob this just stole the show for me though i love that they've created this set i think it's really cool the stamps fantastic the little melty spoon is really good just love how it's all presented i think it's really cool it felt really special to open and yeah i think they kind of smashed it out of the park with this theme if i'm completely honest i've really i've been really enjoying the akio boxes lately well let me know what you've been thinking have you been enjoying watching them maybe you've received them yourself leave a comment down below as usual i'll be replying to lots of those but if you did enjoy this video and you would like to see more then don't forget to give this video a magical thumbs up for me as that does really make a difference and lets me know what you're enjoying but yeah i'm gonna go find places for all of my things um i actually have like a folder which i collect greetings cards in so that i always have one for every occasion so there's a little top tip from me to you um collect these kind of things because then you don't have to be kind of caught out if it's someone's birthday you're like oh i was already prepared for that uh, anyway uh i hope you all doing really well and you've had a good day thanks for watching and i will see you in my next video bye guys very nice